seven new features which are present in MIUI 14. So we have a beta build of MIUI 14 available. Now do note this is the China build and some of the features which I show you in this video might not ever make it to the global and the international builds. So keep that in mind before you continue watching this video and of course another thing i would like to tell you is that there aren't many changes in the control center miui 14 is basically concentrating on giving you a more different looking ui with some more customizations to your folders your icons and your widgets first up all the beta builds which have released of miui 14 so far are actually based on android 13 which is pretty surprising but it is good to know as well and a good thing to have and why is that well that is because remember that miui is a skin on top of android and in the past they have released builds of miui latest builds with previous android versions so it is good to see that the latest miui version which is miui 14 is an actual based on the latest android version which is android 13. next up as with every miui release xiaomi claims that they have improved the system performance optimized the system but this time around they also claim that they have reduced the size of system so if i go into the storage details you will notice that system now occupies 12.06 gb on my xiaomi mi 11x or the poco f3 which they say is 1.5 gb less than the previous miui builds so again they have reduced the system storage storage size in MIUI 14. The next fancy feature which Xiaomi claims to bring with MIUI 14 is something called super icons. So if I swipe over to my other home screen you will notice that the security application has a different looking icon shape. Now how do you achieve this? Well for starters this I think is only applicable to MIUI applications. So all you need to do is press and hold on the application shortcut. Then you go into set icon and here it is you can see that you can customize the icon size do you want one by one two by one one by two or two by two you do get a preview on the top and in case you want to use any other third party icon developed by a third party developer from the xiaomi theme store you can do that as well those options appear at the bottom i think along with the price but me personally let us say i want to use this and then you tap on the check mark on the top right you will get applying on the bottom and then pretty soon the icon should change and bam there it is change applied successfully on my home screen the gallery icon is now a bit different next up with miui 14 xiaomi also brings you fancy looking widgets so for starters you can access the widgets for a specific application from the launcher itself so again press and hold on the application and then on the pop-up screen you can select widgets so this is going to show me all the widgets which are available for the gallery application then you also have fancy widgets like the clock over here the weather over here then this music player over here this is also a pretty fancy widget with a cool looking animation other than that you can always press and hold on the widget and you get the option of switch so in case you want to change to another widget over here where the clock is selected all colors and i think these are the ones which are available on their theme store then this tetris looking clock is my personal favorite so far Next up, we have changes to the folders on your home screen. So here it is, this is a folder. Now, for starters, before you ask me, hey Manji, how do I achieve this look? Well, you create a folder and then again, you press and hold, go into edit folder. So you have two different options, regular, which is your old school style, which you used to get in MIUI 13. Then you also have enlarged. Now, once you choose enlarged, a special thing to note over here is that these three icons, which are bigger than the other four, if I tap on any of them, it is going to open that specific application. But in case you want to access the other apps within this folder you have to tap over here and that is going to show you all the apps which are part of this folder and the animation here no doubt is pretty smooth 
Next up, the memory extension feature in MIUI 14 is a bit more customizable. So if you go into settings, additional settings, and then I go into memory extension, you will see that I can choose between off 2 GB, 3 GB, and 5 GB. Previously, you could not choose the different options. So for 6 GB of RAM, I think you would get 2 GB, and for 8 GB of RAM, you would get 3 GB out of the box. But with MIUI 14, you can change how much expandable memory you want to use on your Xiaomi device. Next up, they have combined a few different menus. So if you go into settings, additional settings here and you go into floating windows, you will notice that they have combined sidebar, app flashcards and conversation bubbles. Now, super important thing to note is that you can now open a maximum of two applications in floating windows. So as you can see, I have the messaging app and I also have the music app in a floating window. Let us say I open open the gallery application then the application which I opened in floating window first disappeared so the messaging app disappeared but the music and the gallery application are still over here in floating windows and you can always move them to the side so that you have a non-disturbing view and if you want to access it you just tap over here and the application opens up similarly you can do that with the gallery app as well now another important feature which you might want to know is if you press and hold on the sidebar you can actually move it around to wherever you want to. So we just move the sidebar from the left to the right. Next up with MIUI 14 you also get some new static wallpapers. So unfortunately no new live or super live wallpapers but if I go into the wallpapers option you will notice I have six new static wallpapers for MIUI 14 and then you have some nature patterns, some curves and I think this crystallization and the molten glass was present in MIUI 13 as well but please feel free to correct me if I am wrong. So all in all MIUI 14 is more about the visuals than about adding new features because your wallpapers and personalization, your always on display and lock screen, your display settings, all of these are almost or exactly the same without any new features over here. But yes, you do get the new fancy looking widgets, the super icons, the new folders, a bunch of new wallpapers and of course they have reduced the system size by 1.5 GB along with Android 13 out of the box.